putting the chat up there. Yeah, like That's what I said. Yeah. Work first. Stop making his way. We're like the penguin said to the bartender, "This is my most casual outfit." Is that the correct one? <laughs> <laughs> It's not. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, no, that's good. It's not this one. It'll have been blown out. You're good. It's not. Why don't not, you just turn that one off? I don't you're using this one. Like power. Like turn the power off. So you, I'm pretty sure it's good. Yeah, it's not this one. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Hello. Hello, everyone. I'm Hugo. I'm Jake. And I'm Paul. I'm rolling into frame. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I'm the Paul Allen. Our pillow came to life. <laughs> <laughs> isn't that, isn't that, I like to. We got the we got the pillow before Paul existed. So like and then you wished wished wishing. you wished that I would be here. Yes, and you literally wished me into existence. Yes. Of course, I mean literally, figuratively, for the. So we're here to answer your questions. Open packages. Yeah, he, he brought some stuff. I apparently, <laughs> uh, gifts. Things that you can't send through the mail legally. Or oh. not advisable to send through the mail. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, do I sound okay? I'm really far away. I'm probably fine. Okay. So what no. are we? So there's there's yeah. stuff up there. We have chat. <laughs> yeah, our, big TV. Yeah. We have a TV up here now, which he helped set up. <laughs> well, I've had this for ages. Yeah, but now it's on the wall. Yeah. We can see the Paul chat. Was the catalyst behind the decision? Uh, yeah. So uh, that's what's happening. We have this right here. Let's Paul, do this. Paul, Chris in the show. Wait, do you, do you smell them first? I should tweet about this. Only if they're full of anthrax. Okay. Oh, good. Okay. Just, you know. You should tweet. Anthrax? You're just, you're Twi Twitter Her. and Discord, unless uh, Sarah already did it. Not sure. You just tear her open. Just get after it. Whoa, <laughs> my goodness. Whoa. Premature package opening. It happens yeah. to the best of us. It's your first <laughs> time here. We understand. Uh, it's, it's let's see. Oh, there's natural. a thank you. Hey guys, or a gift for you. Hey guys, love your channel. Thank you. Hope you can use this review, or hope you can. Hope you hope you yeah, can on, use Paul. this to review those VHS tapes. Oh. Ooh. Uh, 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 uh. Oh. 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 It's a capture thing, so we can watch VHSs <laughs> and rip stuff. Uh, legally. Legally. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. Well, we have for, I don't have a disc drive. That's all you. For fair fair use, obviously. Yes. yes. Cool. <laughs> Very you, cool. Friend. Thank you. Oh, I'm sorry. Does it say who it was from? Did it say who it was from? I have to I have to share this. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I'm ben not, F. I'm Thanks, not, Ben F. I'm not ignoring everyone. I'm just, I just <laughs> have to... And I know that there is a I don't I know that there is a procedure for there is a Do procedure. we have a bag this time? Sarah told me she'd be she'd yell at me <laughs> if I made this, a mess this time. We literally had this last time. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, I'm just throwing it out there. It has existed this, for quite some time. Is that that is a trash can? I, oh. I believe they're called trash cans. <laughs> or waste bin. Waste that, uh, I, it feels like it should be regional, you, but I don't know I what think. region. Uh, yes, to both of us. Okay, so you can have that. Ooh. I'm glistening right now because I I did I did things. We did manly work earlier today. We well, no, <laughs> it's just hot here. How are you wearing that? I um, I uh, I am also glistening. I'll probably end up taking this off. After I really I, I really should have hit the powder harder before we came the in powder. here. Powder. <laughs> we have cocaine, guys. <laughs> What is what is this? I don't know. They're some sort of uh, are those holographic cards of some sort? They're all, see one. Many of them are right of the rating? same thing. Order X order. What is Project this? Indigo, Indigo War Zone. I don't know what this is. Rogue. Let me see what is in, and there's just a nice pen. Okay, but is there a letter? No. No, I'm very confused. Are what does you, it say? Wait, who is it? Sparking tournaments come. Oh yeah, sparking tournaments. Something North Carolina, maybe. It's hard to. This sounds like a card game I'm unfamiliar with. Yeah, oh, this is a test. It kind of is a test batch. Test zero point one. Oh, did we, get, did we get the? Are we on the ground level of the new Magic yeah, that's the Gathering odd that they style game? Interesting. Okay, that's odd that they wouldn't like. Put Vol it... Volchair, the arbiter. Athenian adept telemancy. A portal is not a door to where it is a path to how. Oh, wait. A portal is not a door to where it is a path to how. And he's a rogue. It looks like some sort of a... Uh, yeah. 
It's like a card game with different huh. uh, stats and stuff. That's pretty cool. They, those are, may I, may I? Yeah. These are, I mean, these are really nice. Yeah, here's another one. They're like a nice foily. Um, and they also, they gave you these really nice holders too. Mm -hmm. I'm not really into cards. Yeah, and but... it has, of course, you know, like stuff like retreat cards and stuff. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, you have, the, what's the website? I assume they have a website. They, no. they didn't, there's a really sparse on information. Hold on, yeah. I'm gonna Google if, this. If now. only I could have <laughs> mo more complete information. What's it called? <laughs> Project Indigo Wars. If you want to send us cool stuff about your startup thing, maybe include a business card. Try to. Product. Maybe there is, but I'm just stupid. No, I, this I, is from Sparking. It's tournament. It kind of got rubbed off there. I'm looking at it right now. It doesn't. Here we go. Any? Yeah. There's no actual info. Okay, they have a Kickstarter. Oh. Uh, Project Indigo War Zone War Game slash TCG, which means something that I don't know. Table card game. Oh, table card game. That makes sense. Okay. Uh, so you can check their project out at kickstarter.com slash... Oh, God, that's a difficult <laughs> fucking... Okay, just Google Project Indigo War Zone Kickstarter, and you'll be able to find it. You can check out all the stuff that the project is about. Ooh. You can see all their goals and all that stuff. Wait a second. Uh, and all that cool stuff. We have... Okay, so I'm now seeing I'm now seeing a difference here. Okay. Okay, so each of these cards, mm -hmm. it's really hard to pick up. They're each layout... Their layout's different. Okay. By the way, uh, this layout... Uh, <laughs> that one with the dark... with the, That's the one. Yeah. That's the one. I'm assuming that we're supposed to pick. You see what I'm saying? They're all there's the same card, but they're different layouts because it's a test batch. Oh, yeah. I understand. Oh, I get. I, I get what you're saying. Yeah. So, gotcha. Yeah, but I definitely think the. Uh, I agree. The black one, like by far, is the best. It's not even close. If you're looking at all three, it has all the information I want right away. And it was visually much more interesting, yeah. I think. Striking. Yeah, yeah. it's uh, that's what you want. Especially if you're gonna go with the holographic for all of them. Yeah, the black on like yellow or gold yeah, looks it really, really nice. It really helps me read it. And it pops. Uh, and it helps me read the bottom too. So yeah, that's the way to do it. Send us your test cards, kids. And if you send us a full thing of this, we'll I'll I'll fucking you want to play this game? If you if you uh, maybe. if you successfully kickstart this or you get a whole test batch and like some rules together and send it to us, we'll play it and we'll let you know what we think and we'll talk about it to people probably too. I think there's things loose in this package. Hmm. Um I would also Jay, I'm just spitballing here, maybe. Uh if you send any more, maybe sign one of them, one or two <laughs> of them on the back. Yeah, that's a good that's a good thing. I'm also in agreement because these like these like I don't know what you call these kind of cards that are like characters. Those are like power, power, yeah. power up, tactical, whatever you call these. These are also in yellow or that kind of gold, and it matches. So yeah, I'm gonna go with yeah. that as well. That really might be cool, the one though. they've already decided. Did you did you snag that pen? <laughs> did I? Yeah, you totally snagged that pen. <laughs> you know how I feel about pens. Well, you did know, I put it somewhere? I don't know. It's not in here. The pen is mightier than the it's not sword. Not in here. Oh god, we lost the fancy pen. <laughs> We lost the it's pen. It's right here. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. It is a nice pen, though. Here. Let's put it in there. <laughs> is, it, is it, like, is it engraved? Uh, it has their business name on it, I bet. It's, it's laser etched. Man. Paint. Spar King Tournaments. Come meet the competition. We already said that. Yeah. That is that is quite handsome. That is a handsome pen. It's a good way to get free ads. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's a good way to send us stuff. <laughs> we'll probably promote it. Pimp it, if you will. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, not a good way to get paid, though. So also send, <laughs> send money along with that. <laughs> Pretty please. The checks made out to cash. Uh, also, uh, we will be reading super chat. So if you want to do that, that's fine. Um, I just want to make sure we're you let you know that we're not ignoring you. Yeah. Um, I feel like there's loose things in here. Ooh. So where's it from? It's from. Uh, Riverview, Florida. <laughs> yeah. Anything from Florida concerns me. <laughs> Anything from Florida? I don't trust Floridians. Why? I've been to Florida. I like to think so of Florida I. as America's wing. It's, it's, That's a very original joke that I bet no one has ever said before. <laughs> it definitely didn't hear it on the census. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it's got a special place in my heart. I lived in Florida for a while as I struggle with this. Um... <laughs> Surprising amount of meth. And like oxy. you wouldn't think in a place that's like got oranges growing on trees that you'd need to refresh yourself with meth <laughs> quite as often. I, I know that at least in the past that Florida was known for like being an oxy mill where you could fly down to Florida. I'm really glad I opened this like that. 
Okay. I don't know. Are those packing things? Okay. Hold on. We have. I have some. There's like Lucky Charms in here or something. <laughs> okay. Uh, here is a, a note. Dear Hugo and Jake, you guys are really funny, and I love the channel. The box contains my version of fan art. There's one for each of you. Hope you like them. Aww. So there's another one in here? Or is there just two in this box? Okay, so this, it's filled with this. These are little paper-folded <sighs> stars. Oh, I love these. I as, love, as the, I've never seen this. Is this a form of packing material? As, no, it's, it's, no, it's like an origami. Is this something you buy, or is no, this, I think this person, this yeah, person right. folded these well, individually? Look, look, because I have a Starburst one somewhere in here. Yeah, this so, is a this is a thing. I've seen this done. Before. Holy shit! If you've hand folded <laughs> packing peanuts, um, okay. Do you just have a <laughs> fucking anxiety disorder, and you do this to like, you know, one more day? You gotta know, fold more fucking stars are, so I don't blow my brains out. Beads. Well, you know, the idle idle is. hands are the devil's playground. No, I don't know what these are. Yeah, there is are so many. Minecraft creeper. What is it? Hold on. I I have to. I really have to resist the urge to throw all these in the air. I don't necessarily know what this is, but thank you for making. Is it, it for beaded? Me. It is beads. It is. It, is. it looks very hard to me. I like it, and the yeah. star thing's awesome because yes. it's like a. I don't know how closely you guys can see this, but it's like a three D star made out of beads. Yeah. It's oh, weird. it's Harold Penisman's face. Where? Uh, this. Is it? Yeah. What the <laughs> fuck? Don't you see it? It's Harold Penisman colors. You have so many talented fans. Yeah, yeah we really do. <laughs> it's craziness. So yeah. That's, what's on the What's on the top then? This I'm a little more perplexed by. If the is person that, who made this, the chick track. track. <gasps> oh my <laughs> god, it is! Look at that. It's like a little bitty chick track. It's it's us slowly unlocking what the fuck this is. <laughs> You're more talented than we are observant. That's amazing. You did such a fucking good job. I'm really observant too, for real. This is honestly one of the cooler things anyone's ever sent us. Sorry, Paul. Sorry, Paul. So I had to send it while I was here. <laughs> Very cool, though. Thank you. Yeah. That's awesome. It is cool. This is actually yeah, going I, on I, my keychain. I, 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 cool. Who was that from? I'm worried about putting it on my keychain because I don't want it to break, so I'm putting mine up here. Okay. I bow down to you. It was It was from Cindy. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you, Cindy. You rock. This is icy cold. It's delightful. Yeah. Okay, uh, your phone is on your leg. What? You got some phone? Oh, there's a super chat. I'm getting a message. The Mickey Ficky. Uh, <laughs> I'm jealous of Paul. I want to be the number one fan. Uh, go to college. <laughs> uh, Try, you know, you got to study hard. Yep, you got to study real hard. And be uh, uh, just a, a, a giant gay super cool guy. <laughs> and then there you go. <laughs> Also, uh, Paul had points, and he flew here. So, yeah. uh, I didn't pay for that this. helps, too. Yeah. Uh, uh, there you go. Oh, is my turn again already? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh. It's definitely down here. I figure we'll hang out. <laughs> I'm definitely not missing anybody, right? I don't think so. If okay. anyone got missed, let us know. All right. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, I'll uh, do the note first. Sarah will let me know if yeah. you miss anybody. Okay. Sometimes I don't stand up for a long time. Oh. All right, dearest, I added the dearest. Dearest Hugo and Jake, <laughs> here's some Ten Commandments dice to decide which commandment your D&D characters should break at any given opportunity. That's nice. That's Opportune nice. moment. Big fan. Hope you guys like it. And have a great day. Y'all the, the best. Y'all the best. From Matthew Men Mendel. You want to just live in this room? You do a good job of reading those. With <laughs> I can, I'm like I'm like the guy on the I'm like the what's his name on the Price is Right, Matthew Mandel. See, we need to bring in fresh faces, <laughs> people who haven't been doing this so long that they've lost the will to live. You're, yeah, <laughs> I'm I'm not jaded. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> it comes. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Yes, yeah. and then, then there was something actually in the packet. It's dice. It's dice. It, it, that's a fucking sweet yeah. dice. It's like a dreidel. <laughs> that's like a D10, but yeah, ten command. Oh, of course, it's ten commandments. Duh. Shut up. Let I me just you. put that in the trash. I've there. always loved you, Hugo. <laughs> I wish it, it, you know. A lot of people, at least, they get to say, "At least you're pretty." Not here. Oh God, my phone's going. It's that's a very noises. Cool. It's really. That's really really. Cool. 
I actually, you should keep this down in the DMD so. stuff. I don't know what we'd use it for, but it's hilarious. Yeah, it is. By the way, by the way, uh, first of all, I got to roll with it. Uh, we need to break the do not do not commit adultery. So none. Of I'm you, on it. None of you touch my wieners. <laughs> um, I don't think we missed any Wait, of the super chat. Scott, you're not watching, are you? Scott, no, no. He didn't come visit because he doesn't <laughs> love us the way the way you do. Uh, um, Andy had to work, you know. Someone's got a nice a job. <laughs> um, this this ain't cheap. So, <laughs> so Paul and I have been doing home improvement. We've been quite the busy beavers. We the beavers, busy beavers. I always thought heard busy bees. No, buzz, beavers. Buzz. I've only ever heard busy okay. beavers. This okay, is, wait. Do you this like is musicals? Do I like musicals? Okay, he loves musicals. I love musicals. He's, he's apparently straight as an arrow. So what I was going to say is this is the musical part. You guys say busy beavers. I'm the uncultured swine. <laughs> I say busy bees. Oh, wait. Are we turning it in? I like busy beavers as I'm I not walk doing down that with the you. street. No, you're hung out to I'm dry kinda, right now. Again, I'm right. I'm too jaded. I can't do it. <laughs> I like beavers. And, 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 and I was, that makes that me was... sound like I'm protesting hard, <laughs> uh, way too hard. And I really just, I, I just, I don't. I was also ripping off My Fair Lady there. Just <laughs> <laughs> There's like three My Fair Ladies there. They're like, Paul, <laughs> you credit them. Anyway, uh, we have, uh, this is, uh, we ran um, lines down from right here over the corner and downstairs. Uh, so now we have a hard network connection for when uh, we reach our Patreon goal of 2,500. It's to, within striking distance, It is right? within striking distance. Uh, mm. To uh, stream our D&D sessions. I'm looking so forward we have, to that. So we are hardwired uh, downstairs. I have uh, internet connection. Down Step one. Step one. Um, and we also hate mounted... Paul Allen. Well. Maybe. Oh wait, wait. Was it? I hate. I thought you said Sayu I hate Kirabushi. The bottom one. Can oh, I can Paul? I date? I thought you said I hate Paul Allen. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, no, he's sure. married. Well, you know, they might have an arrangement. <laughs> you know, that's you know, we can. Paul is on vacation. It's very different. Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> How many more miles do you have left? <laughs> Here you go. I gotta change my get, ticket. Get, get, this is from William, all the way in Salt Lake, USA. Wow, did they type this on that a That is an actual typewriter. This looks like yeah. a typewriter thing. I think this person has sent this stuff before typed on okay. a typewriter. Hipster you remember that? Alert. I don't know. Does this person know Tom <laughs> Hanks? I assume all typewriter users know each Every other. Every time we bring up typewriters, it's a Tom Hanks Because reference. that's the one typewriter <laughs> thing I know. There's a documentary on Hulu called California Typewriter. Actually, pretty interesting. It's about one and of the it's last. It's all about Tom, Tom Hanks? It's not all about Tom Hanks. He's in it a little bit. It's about. Uh, one of the last like typewriter repair shops. Yeah, and it's really, really interesting. So watch that. I assume this person probably has seen it and enjoys What's it. What's your favorite kind of typewriter? Electric? Manual? You know what's cool? The fucking ball head ones. Oh, yeah, the IBM Selectric wheel writer. Because what the fuck is going on? Because <laughs> are, we, are, we, are we having a powwow about typewriters? <laughs> Let me explain why, though. It's actually because it, it, it's so interesting to see where that technology, it makes me think where typewriters would have gone had the digital revolution not have happened. And I know that's not an analog technology. That is digital. But if computers and no, that no, sort of it's... thing hadn't taken off, how complicated typewriters could have gotten as a mechanical machine because that ball head typewriter, if you see it work, it's crazy mechanical genius. Yeah, it's not digital. It's all like hard, you yeah. know, like you just complete a circuit. In Interesting. Do you know what I'm talking about? Have you seen this kind of typewriter? Is the ball head, does it have all the stamps? It's all the it little letters. On yeah. one and, yeah. it just and it just spins around. around. That's crazy. <laughs> and it's super fast. Yeah. It's crazy. It's I'm, amazing that it works so well. Yeah. Anyway. and the, It is typed. See, this is the <laughs> same And this guy. is beautifully typed. Anyway, I'm a little jealous, I gotta say. 30th of April, 2018. Dear Hugo and Jake, I feel like I'm about to read like a ransom note from the 20s. <laughs> Dear Hugo and Jake, we've got the we've got Wait, the no, baby. You have to do it in a, like an Atlantic accent. Transit Dan, Transatlantic. Transatlantic accent. We've got the Lindbergh baby under wraps here. Uh 22 Skadoo. Uh we <laughs> actually dropped it when we uh, when we're going down the ladder. Oh, the yeah. Lindbergh I baby watched is that. dead. Wouldn't that have been whole? Not That's whole. how it died. Okay, basically. you know what? The Lindbergh baby has been dead long enough where this is funny. Wouldn't it have been hilarious if they kidnapped the Lindbergh baby and they le legitimately dropped it and they're like, oh, fuck. I'm pretty sure I'm that's, pretty, what, that's happened. what happened. I'm pretty confident that. Because there Did was a ladder yeah. and the that door was open or the window was open and then like the baby ends up dead. 
But you know, the fascinating. I don't People know. Just like strangle babies a lot when they want money. If you um, walk, there's a fascinating documentary. Uh, I believe it's Nova about the Lindbergh kidnapping. I feel like I saw this. And yeah. they and they actually the it was early forensics because they. Uh, the, the ladder that they used to steal the Lindbergh baby was made from like, they were able to find out that it was made from the wood of someone's attic of the house that they lived in. Mm -hmm. It was really, really interesting. And unfortunately, I don't know, there's some people that think they didn't get the right people and they have DNA samples, but the New Jersey police, state police won't let them test it against the people that they think it was done. Dead baby. Fun fact. <laughs> Fun dead baby fact. There are like two famous babies, the Lindbergh baby and the Gerber baby. What about and one of their boss both? boss baby right after the fat thing? What about wait that what? Because that was what? Well, no, no, because boss baby was uh, Louis C.K. Right? No. Who's, was, who does boss baby? Alec Baldwin does boss baby. The whole, Louis, Louis, Louis C.K. C. Oh no, he's in Life of Pets. Secret Life of Pets. Very Isn't similar. It? What about the baby Jesus? Oh, come on. He grew, <laughs> baby Jesus. He fun. grew up into adult Jesus. We all adult know that. Adult Jesus is way more popular than baby Jesus. Lindbergh baby didn't grow up constantly a baby. A uh, dead one, but a baby. What about what about uh, John Benet Ramsey? Toddler. No, she was like she was six. She was not she was not a toddler. Six? She yes. was ambulatory she was and she was six. talking. Ambulatory. Did you guys, we, we, was, we should not consider six year olds. She was in a beauty pageant. All six-year-olds are trash. I'm going to read this typewriter. No, no. <laughs> okay. Hopefully this doesn't have to do with dead baby. I'm feel wow. bad. Dear Human Jake, I recently lost my child, and you've been helping a lot. Please don't be that William. I'm glad you enjoyed my last letter. My typewriter is an old Sears commentator one. That means something to people who know about more about typewriters than myself. It's way better than the commentator zero. I did. I typed your name Pooal instead of Paul in the title. <laughs> That'll change later. I'm busy. From what I have been able to gather, it's really a rebranded brother. While it is electric, it still has the strike arms associated with most typewriters you see instead of something like a daisy wheel. I don't have correction ribbon, so I'm sure you'll see plenty of mistakes. Oh, I see. The thing that you... Yeah. Have you ever seen videos on YouTube of Christians bashing other Christians for not believing in Jesus the same way? I saw one where someone was calling out Ray Comfort for preaching grace. Uh, oh, overwork. Grace oh. overworks. Yeah, you typed over it. Or some other nonsense. I couldn't watch it for long because I felt like it was giving me cancer. Do you guys want to want us to watch uh, Christian throwdown stuff where they, they, they argue against each other and we just sit here and laugh? We commentate on it. Society is winning. That's kind of funny. Uh, I wish religion would go away forever. Words have more weight to them when they're typewritten. Have you noticed that? Yeah, I, I, feel, like, I feel like he really means it. Yeah. yeah. Effort was put into this. If there is a god, do you think he could make a blunt so big that even he could smoke, not couldn't smoke at all? <laughs> I don't know why I keep insisting in my head that God is a man. My boyfriend keeps saying that if there were a god, she'd be a black lesbian dwarf. Happy many returns, William. P.S. Hugo's fake guitar playing makes me wet. Wait a second. Okay. What? Were you surprised it might be a woman? Yeah. Why? William. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's not. He just gets wet. Oh, okay. That's that can, fine. Uh, that's guys fine. can get wet. We get moist. We can't really get wet. You know. And well, he maybe William can though. Well, but, well, but I don't want to besmirch William's wet what ability. What about the, the little stuff that comes out beforehand? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yes, what about? <laughs> Contemplate that. Mm, okay. Do we want to do this big box first or Paul's gifts? Wait, Distant. I had a, I had a big box. Okay, but I'm using okay. it to lean on. And it's really nice. <laughs> That's why I asked. <laughs> Not going to lie to you. So wait, what are we? Oh, so if you do those um, Christian on Christian debate mm, things, yes. you need to get like, oh, there's a super chat. We'll get you, you in just a second. <laughs> right after these words from Paul. You need like a one of those uh, scoreboard things that you can like flip. Yeah, <gasps> good idea. Not See, we should do. Well, he's, he's a good idea guy. I got ideas. He can't go home. Put him, put him in this closet. Sorry, you got to go back in the closet. No, this and scary, uh... the scary room downstairs. I do have a rape room. Yeah. yeah, it's really it's unsettling. Scotty P Gaming, I officially volunteered to be a proxy Scott if Paul is ever in my area. You guys are awesome. What area? You gotta. 
Yeah, that, that <laughs> fell apart. Paul is no longer willing and to And let me visit. just say, don't write checks with your ass that your mouth... Wait, don't write... Don't write checks hey, with no, your no, mouth. No, 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 I got it. I'm just, you know, it's take two. Take two. Yeah. Don't write checks with your mouth that your ass can't catch. Which has a double entendre in this case because you just solicited <laughs> him for sex on the internet. <laughs> Unless you just wanted to be his husband... But like, but like, you want like a 15, you could be my, 15 years deep where the the sexual tensions kind of like I could be one of those evaporated people. and we're just old together. No, I, you could be my Minnesota husband or my, <laughs> my, my Michigan. <laughs> yes, I want a Michigan husband. It's awesome. Woo. The vapors are getting to me. It is. It's getting steamy. Yeah. This is like the second screen, by the way. <laughs> you don't understand what yeah. they are going through. You need to go to Patreon right now. Yeah, because then <laughs> we got two super chats. <laughs> Professor, yeah, what's better, fur, fur, futas or femboys? Femboys. <laughs> you know the definition of what a you know, futa is? I thought it was the same thing. I'm it's an it's a, it's a anime girl with a dick. Okay, so I like them boys then. Okay, this one seems important. The package with the Ding Ding Swastika movie got ate by postal machines and was returned to me. Oh no! I repackaged it. You should have it for the next unboxing. Bye from your Klingon. Oh yeah, it's Josiah. Ah, cool. Uh, who do <laughs> oh, this. I don't know who did this, but they're about to get. Okay. Mad love. Okay. I desperately want to call dibs on this. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> this doesn't have... Oh, there's a note. I gotta get to the note. I can't. <laughs> okay. Do you want me to read the note? Hi, Hugo. I hear you like Power Rangers. <gasps> it's for me, bitch. <laughs> I, I wasn't going to actually call dibs. I wanted to. Oh, is this going to be something I'm going to be super fucking excited about? Yeah. Am I going to be really happy about this? You, may, you, may you guys are the best. You may shed a tear. <laughs> oh, wait. There's another super chat. Should we do that first? Yes. <laughs> Scotty P. Kennedy, I'm it. a chef in southeastern North Carolina, so I can be a, the stay at home. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Your luck with Scott's is really good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna show. Don't look at the TV. Don't look at the TV. I'm just gonna show them. Okay. I'm just gonna show Wait, them. Can I look? Okay. There you go. <gasps> <laughs> look at that, face. that face is so worth it. <laughs> oh, 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 whoever gave me this, thank you. Is it? I had... Is it the toys or is it the model? I. Because I want to play with them with you. <laughs> Wait, can you open it? Yeah, oh yeah. Fucking oh open it. It's from Japan though, so like. Do you have a knife? I no. I have scissors. I'll get you those. Be careful, we. Use... <sighs> oh, those are different ones. Aren't they? F what a great, what a just a great thing. This is like so nice. I'm so wait, seriously, it's, it's, it's probably the mo the, mo the mo one of the most thoughtful. I know. Hugo gifts. Our fans ages. are so nice. I told Who is you. this from again? Uh, it was Scotty. It's the it's like the toy I had when I was a fucking child. Exactly. <laughs> Me too. It's beautiful. All the little pieces are here. We're gonna play with it so much. <laughs> Someone send me the dragon sword so we can play. Look at this shit. This is fucking fantastic. Pull one out because you gotta touch it first. But then I can, okay. I want to touch one. <laughs> I'm gonna go. It's with. been it's been actual years. I gave Steven. I almost guarantee this is better made than the one I had as a child. I don't but know. in my head, this is exactly what it was like. I don't know Steven's last name. But, oh uh, my god, thank you yeah, so much. You are on point, Steve. This is um, I you know what? As a kid, I had trouble putting like the Megazord together. I bet as an adult I still will. <laughs> oh, this is heavier. Yeah. No, oh, this is oh, this is like made look of at this. die cast metal. Look at it. Look at it. They fold right in. It just folds <laughs> and it. Come on, man. Come on. And oh, and this folds back so you can have like wrists. This is fucking awesome. This is ridiculous. Seriously. Thank you so much. Yeah. This, so is, wait, this so, is way better than the toy I had. You know, I'm, so, I desperately want the Dragon Zord now. I don't know how to do that, but. 
Um, I'll, okay, I'll, I'll be honest. Questions. Yeah, Power Rangers were just a little past. You know, I was. I'm just a little. Yeah, I hit it at the heyday. He came in after, so he watched like the second and third series. Yeah. Okay, so, so this we're is where all they at go. different stages of Power Rangers. So this is where they go. They put their rings, and they're like Earth. No, <clears throat> that's 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 Captain Planet. Our powers combined. No, that's still Captain Planet. Oh, these guys have morphers. Did you know that? Captain Planet had a very special episode about someone with AIDS. I do. Really? I did know yeah. that. There was also an episode about overpopulation where they went to an island of rat people and then all the rats died of overpopulation. <laughs> did Thanos show up? But they were sentient rats with like a society and they were like, don't overpopulate or this will happen to you, kids. And it's very, like, I don't know what to do about this. I'm nine. <laughs> don't fuck. Don't fuck. By the way, this well, is but, and just as, uh, Oh, I know. I'm gonna end up They're in Japanese, but they, they have probably have pictures. Um, just as a note, the kid that had AIDS in that episode of Captain Planet got it through a blood transfusion. Yeah. Right, not the not the not the butt not way. the sin way, Paul. <laughs> there are ways to prevent that. And there's a pill now. Did you know that um a study came out? I brought this up recently, but um a bunch I had a bunch of homophobes uh on Twitter. I didn't actually engage with them, but there was a study that came out. Very obviously saying if you lose if you use saliva for lubricant, it, it's bad and you can spread diseases easily. Yeah. And then but it was specifically like they were they were hanging on like on people to do butt stuff, which by the way, straights do it. Hugo and I love it together. We're straight. I know. Uh, but uh it's like they're, that, so they're know. like gays are bad. It's like well, what about lesbians? Like you only think about gay dudes is what you... There you go. Yeah, Wait. it has picture aid, so you're good. Yeah! <laughs> By the way, this is, this is like... Japan's toys are way better than American. Well, this toys. is like an. This is made for adults. This is like similar to the Hasbro. This is so Legacy awesome. Line. This I'm, is. I'm genuinely happy about this. This is awesome. Now uh, Paul gets to regale well, us. Now I feel. <laughs> well, well, no. That's well, not we shouldn't have done that one first. <laughs> what do you got, Paul? Yeah, Paul. <laughs> what are you visited? You didn't bring us nothing what? good. My, I, I felt. I feel like my presence. Is a is gift enough? Is that yeah? Okay, yeah, that's bullshit. I brought you actual stuff. <laughs> <laughs> we know that's bullshit. And as just a little fun thing, the bag is actually part of the gift. Oh, so, the Houston Galleria. Yeah, it's actually from H E B. If you if you live in Texas and you haven't gone to H E B, what the hell is wrong with you? Everyone else drive to Texas and go to H E B. Mm, someone said <laughs> if you use saliva, it's not going to have as much slip. As lube causing tears, which lead to disease. This is true. Kids use lube if you got it. It's it, you're adults. They sell it everywhere. Also, it just it's better. Water based if you're using condoms. Absolutely. Just as a you know, a, the more you know type of thing. In general, you really need if you're doing it in the butt, the back door. Yeah. You really need to use lube because there's no natural lubricant down there. So it, you, unless you got the runs, in which case, why are you doing that? You got the runs. You got more issues then, because then you're just spreading more disease. I mean, <laughs> or germ. Yeah. You know, it's just. Yeah. This okay. I have a question. That's a nightmare. That's I have a, a question. This is ask again. Is it one of those Wait, questions we... my ignorant mom would ask? Wait, yes. Can we can definitely? We... And I don't mean ignorant like she's stupid. I mean she's genuinely. She just doesn't understand. This is a question. So, mom, you're watching. I don't mean you're dumb. I love you very much. Can we actually take calls? Because I would love to take. Calls. Okay. Anyone that has <laughs> questions, <laughs> super chat at least a dollar. This question oh, is unacceptable. <laughs> And I do not excuse myself for asking it. But it's Paul! If you're ever like... If you, Wait, let me take my glasses off. If you and your husband are ever like, man, I really want Indian food. Or fucking, I don't know, something oh, really spicy. Preparatory are you like, are you, is one of you ever like, I kind of wanted to fuck later. And you're like, well, that's a risky move. I mean, I know there's stuff other than butt stuff. Yeah, no, I mean, because typically how... It takes about eight yeah, hours. Yeah, that, and... Um, we we do actually so we eat Indian food on a fairly regularly basis, sure. and we don't get the runs from Indian food. I mean, you run that risk of eating anything, really. Right, I guess. Well, uh, like a just spinach salads that'll get me. Oh yeah, no, we don't have that. We don't have problem with spinach either. So yeah, dude, when I eat like just a spinach salad, it just like I feel like maybe you. It's, should... a, it's a fiber thing. I, I eat a lot say, of vegetables. Maybe you, I was gonna say maybe you're not eating enough. No, vegetables. I eat a lot of vegetables. I just that that just really got me. I, I actually, um, 
right before I got <laughs> sick, I got um, I went to Kroger and got a big tray of vegetables. I made homemade hummus, mm -hmm. and I only ate that for two days. <laughs> and then my body went, no, nope, <laughs> eat a cheeseburger. Blah, 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 blah. And then, uh, so I haven't had that hummus since because uh, I felt it just gives me the uckies. Yeah, uh, I love hummus. Vitamin E oil would be, what are we talking about? Okay, I'm going to avoid chat for a minute. Okay. I don't know what vitamin E oils we're <laughs> well, using. Well, you know, vitamin E oil, I guess you could use it as a lubricant, although why? You'd have to, can you imagine like squeezing out? Mineral enough? oil? Oh, oh wait, I thought she said vitamin E oil. They did. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, you know how they come in those little... No, just go to the store and buy fucking lube. Yeah, definitely do that. <laughs> and, you know, I find there's actually... Uh, I don't, Should I say this or should I not say this? Uh -oh. So, for no, people that are... Say it. Okay, yeah. So, for people that are, you know, want to have a little fun on your own, sometimes, you know, if your partner's not in the mood... Yeah, go for it. Um, and you like to watch the videos, uh, try masturbation cream. I'm yeah. sorry, that's a thing? Yeah, that is an actual thing. I'll have to send you a sample. Please don't. <laughs> it, oh, there's a there's a super chat. Yeah, it's 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 uh it's kind of it's almost it's kind of like a Crisco-y consistency. Uh, it's it's very pleasurable. <laughs> oh, uh, Nicole Roberto, oh, yeah. I own a lingerie store. It sounds like a sex store to me. Um, well, for legal reasons, it's a lingerie. Okay. Store. Lots of lube knowledge. Try to only use non-water-based lubricants if it's being used in water petroleum and silicone lubricants are not good for women internally. <laughs> yep. But wait, isn't don't some lube or lubes also affect like condoms? Because I aren't there some lubes that you're not I know supposed you're to... you're supposed to use water-based if you use condoms, because if you use uh what's the other uh, kind oil based yeah. oil based or yeah. petroleum based or whatever, it can it it, it, it can dissolve away yeah, the, 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 the I only like the ones made out of goat intestines. <laughs> Okay, uh, I think they're usually Casanova. made on a sheep. Sheep Whatever. intestines. Yeah, Casanova used the sheep intestines. Yeah, I go, I go for the goats. I like to fuck people with the inside of sheep's. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. And did just, they invent it? <laughs> you know why? They, uh, no, that's that's probably already a joke. Especially for my gay friends out there. Wrap that up because it felt the same. No, I was gonna say, do you think the Scottish invented sheepskin <laughs> condoms so they could fuck their wives and? Uh, or the sheep. They fuck I think sheep. Arabs or Scottish or you know. Yeah, that's a, I society. guarantee that yeah. joke's been yeah. done. Any, to uh, anyone with a staff, really. <laughs> Staffs, yeah. Yep. <laughs> okay, so back back. I'm to the... straight, Lily said. How did how the hell did we get off on this? this Why are they talking about who cares? Okay. JK though, straight as a ruler. That's that's too bad. Oh, I'm gay. Good for you, gent boy. Are you does that mean you're generous? Because Daddy likes money. So, <laughs> so, so do we. Uh, and Dater, not quite straight. So we got a little bit of everybody. Good that's, for you. That's We call that bi. Yeah. Or Dater would like to not be that, though. Why? He would like to be. Oh, well, you're a bi 17 year old quite. girl. Good for you. Straight. Uh, H-E-B. Austin. For the one. Yeah. Coconut oil and goat intestine. Okay, let's get to the... I gotta, oh, wait, there's a bi 16-year-old girl. Well, you should talk to the 17-year-old girl. You guys should DM. Nicole Roberto. <laughs> promise, it really is a lingerie store. I'm a costume and lingerie designer. There are, We have a corset yeah. shop near us that's just like they lingerie sell corsets. There? It wouldn't surprise me if it's like a thing near the checkout, but that doesn't mean they have like dildos that's and stuff. That's interesting to me. Why? <laughs> well, I guess it makes sense. You know, totally you know who's sense. coming in. <laughs> yes, I'll try to come to the Discord more. Uh, is that it's hard to read from way over here? Uh, slaughter round is that slaughter? Slaughter round. Oh, okay, you gotta say it like that. Slaughter. Oh, well, hello, 21 year old male. I'm a gay because it's been, you know, it's fine. It's, okay. a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a, it's a meme. Okay. Um, oh, 25% gay. Okay, so shall, shall we? Yeah, one at a time, nice and slow. Do you want so do you want me to like hand what oh, yeah, you yeah, you okay. hand whatever you feel is, is good. And if we need any prep beforehand, that's fine too. You may want to lube up now. Right. I was gonna say, <laughs> like we've been talking about prep is the theme of this episode. Uh okay, here's the douche. <laughs> okay, Please. so this is more so this is this the first thing, practical. practical. I noticed this actually this would have come in handy earlier. Oh yeah, we were actually <laughs> talking about this. Uh, these are uh, different different uh, razors. So there's three. So you can lose two 
and still have one. Still have one. <laughs> Best bad dragon toy from Professor. Is it Yai? Yoi? Yoi? Yowie. Yowie? Yowie? Yeah. Eh. And just also for the fans out there, I do still have several more clever ways in mind in the future yeah. w without writing a letter to get my point away. I'm very excited. <laughs> I'm going to pick which bad dragon dildo I like the most based they, on they, images. Bad dragon did the... Uh, did the um, is this, a, this is the thing. What's that Fishman movie? Uh, the Shape of Water. Shape of Water. Didn't they make one? Oh, that wouldn't shock me at all. They do stuff like that. They they right. did one when I think Avatar came out. They do ones that are like vaguely Why based didn't we on. Just these earlier? <laughs> well, I didn't want. Yeah, I didn't... that makes sense. Yeah, I'm gonna say to this toilet. one because the girthiness of the balls is appealing. <laughs> are those girthy? I think so. Anyway, what am I missing, am hey. I missing on camera? Oh, the, the camera misses a lot of that. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That scoops up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Scoopy. I like it longer, but that's just... Yeah. Uh, these are for Hugo. What are those? <laughs> I've looked at these at the store before and almost bought them. <laughs> Muffin maker? They're like Reese's little cup microwave holders. They make little, like... uh, you can, like, lava cake things. Uh, do they make that? Like, the stuff's in there already, or...? I think or you, you gotta... No, yeah, no, you, you gotta, gotta make your... Stuff, yeah, you there's, like, recipes it. in there. Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> I'm gonna eat the shit out of these. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, this is a re-gift. My mom, I think, these were in my stocking, like, maybe two years ago. <laughs> Sorry, Mom! <laughs> Thanks, Paul's mom! I know, she's so, a, she's she, a big fan. She, yeah, she's a She shows fan. up a lot. <laughs> um, okay, and, ooh, this is Texas size. It's like a turtle. Like a... This is, are, are we forced to try this right now? I mean, you don't have to. Okay. I kind of like to try it at some point. But well, then let's do it right now. Here, just take a little bite. I'm, I'm making dinner, but let me do it first because I'm the only one here with a thing about you have sharing thing? food. That's weird. You know, you know that about me. Yeah, that's weird. I have a lot of. Neuroses. How do you know I don't have a thing about I could, sharing? Food? I could just cough because yesterday at Harvey's, you said you didn't. I, I that was think, drinks. Uh, that was drinks, and it was there was alcohol in said drink, so it it's different. Okay. I have an opposite side though. Ah, oh, what the fuck? Hmm. Pretty Tastes good. like Jake. <laughs> that is actually really good, though. Yeah, it's like a turtle. Yeah, it's good. It's all yours. Okay. Yeah, you can I have a thing. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you have a what? Eat the back. Oh, sorry. You can just eat up to eat that. Eat the back. Yeah. I'm on a diet anyway. I really shouldn't eat this. Take one oh. bite and throw it away. There you go. There you go. And then you throw it away. Oh, Unless really Paul good. wants the rest of it. No, I'm good. <laughs> that's like a Snickers, but if Snickers was good. It really, it, that's actually really, really apt. It is very um, good. I don't know where this came from, but it ended up in the Hugo and Jake box. The story of, by the way, tell him this. Tell the story of the Hugo and Jake box because this is a thing now. <laughs> so we had a problem. So you know, as you know, for a while I've been sending things. So as I'm out about in my day, and I see I'm out shopping or something or at Goodwill, and I'm like, ah, oh, this is a good. Uh, yeah, this is funny. Yeah. They, they find this funny, and so I buy it, and it just like it's set on my desk or like in the spare bedroom. So we had all, I had all this like shit everywhere and I would, you know, buy it and forget about it. So now you guys in our house have a dedicated Hugo and Jake like tub, like, <laughs> like yeah. a big, like folding tub. And so everything goes in there. And so when I go to send something, I literally just pull it out of the, <laughs> pull it out. So this is one of those sticker books that you get as a kid that have little images and then you can put the stickers on them. Mm -hmm. I get the feeling that we should do a little short thing about this at some point <laughs> and tell our own story with the stickers. I have no idea how I ended up with this. That's a very good. There's yep. Jesus in the electric, or the Joseph in the electric turn color. Blah, blah, you know. The amazing Technicolor dream coat. Yeah. God Thank damn it. You. Andrew Lloyd <laughs> Webber would be ashamed. By the way, I'm glad this is actually uh, going for a while because um, we don't actually have all the packages that we have today. If that makes sense. Yeah, they're in the they're in the post office, but they they lock their doors to the PO box, which area. is weird because it's completely separate from the actual like yeah that was, post office. Because I, I yeah I went up yeah. there and the door was definitely locked. Yeah. I wanted to break it open for with a rock, but someone got cold feet. <laughs> it was me. <laughs> Felony um, felonies are um um they're bad. <laughs> uh, I don't know where I got the Goonies shirt. It might have been a 
crate of some sort. Uh, it gonna, was because I have the same yeah, one. Oh, here, crate. We can do these two at the same time. Ooh, what do we got here? You can use the new capture card. Behold the bridegroom <laughs> cometh. I got to take the sticker off this because I imagine the picture on this is fantastic. The goodwill sticker. <laughs> I actually had to stop getting VHS tapes because I had my the bride groom. Oh yeah, look at that face. That's, that's fantastic. God damn, that's nice. Is that the Lord or Jesus? Let me read the back that's of the, the same. By the way, that's note the same person. Note for anyone making a VHS ten years ago. Uh, that's so hard. Black read. text with a white border is readable on any color. This very hard to read. So I'll read it anyway. <laughs> On Sunday morning, October 1st, 1995, four months into the Brownsville Revival outpouring in Pensacola, Florida, there was a breakthrough into a deeper and more intensified level of this move of God. <laughs> what? That morning, God moved mightily in his sovereign power. Holy Spirit manifested himself in the release of spiritual... Is this a porn? Did you give us a porn? <laughs> It was at the. It was in like. It was on the VHS rack at the Goodwill. <laughs> a freedom of dance and worship, <laughs> and the bestowing of His gracious love upon a congregation seeking the bridegroom's soon return. This message explodes into an impassioned love affair before your very eyes. God's. What did they? Whoever wrote this? Did they have a contest where they're like? How sexual can I make this description before they tell me no? <laughs> go, go right up to the line. Behold, the bridegroom cometh will cause you to come away, my beloved. Okay, I'm not making this up. I'm not that clever, right? No. You know, you know her in the biblical sense. Oh my God! No, seriously, I'm just going to read this whole thing because it keeps going. <laughs> To a hidden place of intimacy with your bridegroom, Jesus, the lover of your soul. It's not, this isn't unintentional. Jesus is fucking your soul I in this. Story There's always this. three people in the room when you're doing it. That's I, how we do it. I, I don't know about you guys. The bride of Christ. <laughs> Wait, just us or straights? Is that what you meant? In general. In general? Just all people? You know. Uh, Four. <laughs> three is, eh, who's someone's left out. Well, not if you do a circle. You, that's a triangle. You can't make a circle with three people. I've actually, we did the math about this one time on a circle of how many people could just a, a continuous fuck circle. It had to be all men, of course, because I don't think, I don't think that, that, would be the, that, that that's too easy. That's too easy. You'd so have you gotta, to all be oh. in unison constantly with the pumping. Yes. Or it'd be no, more no, no, like no, no. General every other. Every, so there had to be an odd number and yeah. every other because the middle one cannot move, right? Because if then then you're all doing this, right? You should have gone to school to be but an if, engineer. But if but if but if it's every other like this, right? So all the guys at uh, this was in McDonald's ages ago. I was 17 <laughs> years old. 17 year old me, uh, my buddy Ryan, Dave, uh, you know a bunch of them. Yeah, Charlie. We 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 like stood in a circle, and we were like, because it was closed, and we're like, okay, this has got to be a thing. <laughs> this got to be a thing. So we stood there. We're like, okay, well, the average the average length has to be pretty long, but not like great, not insurmountable, right? We got to the number thirteen minimum. <laughs> Probably seventeen is is a really good sweet spot for an actual continuous fuck circle. All I have to say standing. is standing. Thank God, I'm sitting down and there's a bag on my lap. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> um. The bride of Christ, the church, is hurriedly being prepared to meet her bridegroom, Jesus. Behold, I come quickly. Stop it! It does not say that. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Behold, <laughs> I come, come quickly. quickly. Some, well, sometimes... Period. Sometimes... It was ex exclamation, I think. You know, I didn't read that. I didn't actually read this when I picked it up. <laughs> We're going to flush it? <laughs> no, it's just hot. Reminder here. that this is the cover. We're going to do the <laughs> shit out of this. Oh, wow. That's uh, another one. So this is a two VHS set called Biblical Parenting. Oh, God. Someone wasn't kind and didn't rewind. Someone didn't rewind. Oh, <laughs> is it this one? Oh, this one's half used. Someone got halfway through this and was like, nah. Yeah. <laughs> Back in the box. Back in the box it goes. Part two, totally Untouched. unwatched. 
<laughs> it is. No, you can even tell because there's there's not even like a little bit of difference. Oh my god. Yeah, this was washed halfway and they're like fucking goodwill with you. Anyway. Well, no, first it sat on a shelf for 20 years. For, yeah, at least. Uh, what was this? Um, it doesn't actually have a publishing date. That's a mark Sometimes of on the true actual quality. VHS, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, here, investigate that while I read the. Well, I was just oh, going to give you the actual tape. Yeah, get in there. Get up in there. So, oh, <laughs> nobody has their PO box on this it. This is from Pastor Scott Gilchrist. <laughs> Over the years, I have found that many people are surprised to learn what the Bible actually says about family relationships. As a fan of the show, you you also feel this way. I think you, you're supposed to kill your son. Yes. And have sex with your father. Their website is still active. Their website is on the tape. Stop it. God <laughs> designed marriage and the family, and he is the expert. His principles work, and it is essential that we follow them so that our marriages and families can be all that they were meant to be. The Marriage and Family Video Collection are practical messages from the Bible designed to help you apply God's principles in the essentials of family life. Learning and applying God's truth is the proven way to build strong, enduring, satisfying family relationships. And then there's a man holding this child who definitely isn't his son, but it was definitely a set picture. All right, there. You can kind of see that right there. Aww. Yeah. Hmm. Good look. It doesn't appear to me, based on this, that... I'd imagine whoever made this is not affiliated with this anymore. Does that make sense? Oh, yeah. <laughs> domain switcheroo. Scheme. I don't know if it's a domain switch, but whoever was in charge of the organization during this, I don't think is anymore. <laughs> oh, Erica, by the way, I, Scott and I met on a location-based gay dating. Location. Grinder? Thank you. I was trying to be, you know. I know, really? Classy, more classy Wait, just, about it. Just, just, <laughs> that's how people who meet on Grinder describe it because they don't want to say we met on Grinder. <laughs> so, so, like, why aren't you on like commercials? Because Grinder cannot lead to a lot of marriages. Because Grinder doesn't need fucking commercials. Grinder <laughs> leads to more relationships than you think. <laughs> like, like, really? Because I, I always I, I have an, I, the at, right? You know, there was a Christian Mingle movie. Grinder movie, you guys. Grinder needs to get on this. right, but but Grinder is definitely a fuck app, like like uh, it's just like Tinder, like Tinder is. Yeah, right? people hook up on Tinder, but then relationships. Yeah, well, I know, but like Tinder isn't where you go for Wait, relationships. Is just Tinder like a the happy one that happening. it would be an everlasting? No, that's, no, 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 no. Tinder that's... swipe life, left swipe oh, right. Which, which one is that? Uh, that's like Match. I don't know, I've never used Tinder personally. <laughs> I'm, of course not. I I I'm, I pick up the ladies constantly. <laughs> uh, right. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then uh, uh, no no that one was uh, eHarmony eHarmony you know I right. think was it eHarmony that got sued because they didn't do gays no they, they, no that was Christian Mingle that got sued and then they settled out of court and I think they made like a gay version did they no I think they just maybe they did and made it separate but yeah. they definitely yeah. had to under the terms of the settlement allow gay Christians onto the site it's interesting that there's like a, a segment of the gay population who wants only another Christian. That doesn't there is, surprise there, me. There, there is a, well, it does there because is a of the, gay well, there Christian component. Like there, that oh, is obviously. A thing. I'm just saying, like, there's enough to there's for, churches for, around it for for like probably that was probably a class action. There's yeah. enough people in America <laughs> who are like, yeah, I'm still religious, yeah. even though they get treated terribly most of the time. Ugh. Yeah, mm -hmm. unless you're in one of those hippy dippy churches, hippy dippy. or the Unitarians, which I swear Unitarians. I apologize if any of you for some reason are Unitarians or just people that want to have somewhere to go on Sunday morning. There's an old <laughs> joke I think that goes with football you? exists. Yeah. There's an old. Have you ever been to a Unitarian service? No, they talk about nothing for but ninety minutes. I've heard the joke that's like, what <laughs> like do you call an Peterson? <laughs> It's like, what do you call an atheist with a kid? A Unitarian. Uh, 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 yeah. Life church. Um, let's what, see. What? Oh, this, so this is for Hugo. I just bought, I just brought this. I read this. I thought this is a, was a good book. I thought you might like it. Okay. It's dirty, about the true story of dirty cops, soccer moms, and reality TV. If you guys, um, if, if you guys uh, listen to This American Life, mm -hmm. the, ta the soccer, uh, the, um, what was it? The soccer mom detectives episode. I didn't see. I didn't hear. Um, I forget what it was. This called. Life PI moms. A, PI moms. This American Life is a great production put on by NPR. By the this way, this is based so on like the same. Yeah, this is the people. people. Yeah, okay. like this is. It's it's a really good book. I I'm really it. hoping a uh, now that it's solved. I'm really hoping <laughs> that uh, this American Life 
um, does the Golden State Killer. I'm not, familiar, I'm not familiar with that either. The the oh, what Michelle McNamara, um, Patton Oswalt's late wife, was mm-hmm. a true crime author, and she uh, basically was writing this book looking for the Golden State Killer, which is uh, one of the most um, prolific uh, serial killers in California history, including Zodiac. I was and, gonna say, yeah, okay. one of the most. And um, uh, like her book, which was just finished by Patton Oswalt and some other people um, after her death. Um, like helped uh, with her research because uh, mm-hmm. she was working along with law enforcement. So part of her research went into actually like catching the guy and they're pretty sure they got him. He was a former police officer. I would love to hear uh, a this American life do like one 10, of- 10 to 12 episode just like thing on that. Because if you haven't listened to this, like a uh, serial is specifically like yeah. my favorite mm-hmm. podcast from them. Serial season one is amazing. Yeah. Everyone should hear it. Did you do all the follow? Like all I the did. Fo- like undisclosed? Yeah, I did and... undisclosed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, which isn't as good, but it is is, is very informative because it's three lawyers. So yeah. It's not quite as. I think it actually got better because they brought I in like so an too. actual actor in season two. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, so that's not like a Jesus y or anything. I just think it was a yeah. good book and I had it. Right. Check okay. it out. Ooh, this is Chow Chow. What's chow chow? It's okay. kind of like a. It's. Kind of, Do you eat this? Yeah. Like you put it on sandwiches. Okay. Like is it like a relish? Yeah, it's kind of like a relish. Should I try this right now? I don't know. I mean, Do you, like I, it you may want to. No, you want to put it on a sandwich, and you may want to like I actually. Smell it though. Okay. Uh, I have had something like this before. This uh, smells a little spicy though. The spicy. I don't. I don't, what. I don't. It's, it's just, just regular. Sandwich. I think it's even for me. I think regular it's chow chow. No, I just get like a like a. I think it's, it's more like okay. So oniony. There is this stuff. I could be wrong. <laughs> I forget what it's called. Oh, I got the juice. <laughs> Pretty okay. Yeah, I it's, think I'll, I'll. It's from Anton. So anyone from Houston knows I, Anton. I'm thinking. Um, oh, like this a is also or something. Uh, you could put that on. They what do you put it on? Like, you, they, what, they're what like on subs. Like, you know, just yeah. mm, like a um, spoonful and they yeah. spread it. Mm-hmm. Um, this is also a re-gift. I really hope my mom's <laughs> not watching. My wow. mom gave me this too. <laughs> it was pretty good though. It yeah. was good stuff. I figured you got on like my it. hands. Yeah, that's good. Um, there's stuff, oh, I forget what it's called. <laughs> it's like a, I don't like, um, uh, what's that? Uh, sauerkraut. I do not like sauerkraut. Okay. But there's a version of it. I don't think it's fermented. And if it is, they cover it up very well. Um, it's it's still cabbage stuff, but it's like a, like mustard and it's like very yellow. But it's super good on hot dogs and really? stuff. I forget what it's called. I had to you, find it. You know, we actually had during World War II, we had a freedom fries type situation. <laughs> okay, where instead of calling it sauerkraut, they started calling it Liberty Cabbage. That's is that nice true? I I mean, I've heard it. Can. Can someone fact check that? Someone fact check it. Even the the Freedom Fries thing was a very, <laughs> very, like, Fox News. Yeah. It was only, like, in the uh, the Capitol cafeteria. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> That's funny. Stupid. <laughs> That's so funny. God damn it, France. Why don't you want to go into wars with us that are unjustified? <laughs> yeah, that's true. I had... Oh, he was on a history test back in the day. Okay. <laughs> I think that I may have... That's, you know, Grandpa Simpson said that on the... Um, what was it called again? Something cabbage? Free liberty. Liberty, oh, liberty, liberty cabbage. cabbage. I, I feel like that term make <laughs> like when the first time you said it, it pinged something like this is the thing you heard. <laughs> that so, sounds like a grandpa Simpson right. or Mr. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Burns thing. Well, ba, 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 ba. Is it upside, upside down? down. Ba, 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 ba. Monumental. Oh, 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 oh. In, in search of uh, it's Kirk Cameron. <laughs> um, do you already have that one? Is, no. No, is America's most. Na- is this the gun one? Did he do a gun one? This one again, Goodwill. Have you watched it? No, it's. Well, I mean, this is sealed, but I mean, have you seen it? No, I just. Oh, okay. It was in the Goodwill. Oof, oof. Let me see. Oh, uh, obviously, grab you on any... them haters. They did the same thing with this that they did on the VHS, by the way. Black text <laughs> over gray. That apparently, is a Christian yeah. in dark movie. blue. Let me read this. Uh, Monumental is the story of America's beginnings, presented and produced by Kurt Cameron. Ninety-minute true story follows this father of six across Europe and the U.S. as he meets historians and experts in an effort to discover America's true national treasure. (laughs) 
Uh, America, the people. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh no, this sentence Here's makes me cringe. Listen to this. The people, places, and principles that make America the freest, most prosperous, and generous nation the world has ever known. America is the best. This is the principles. Jesus Christ, Kirk Cameron. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. He would also say that. <laughs> Please do a yif live. What that? I have no idea what a yif is. Yiffing is masturbating to furry porn. Okay. So you want us to jack off? It also might... Uh, We're switching over to the Bible Reloaded Xtube channel. Right? <laughs> Meh. <laughs> I'm not really into... I might make an okay cam girl like like if you're into that. I don't think so. You don't want to see me jack off? Not even a little. I would. I'm, I'm just being honest. There's one. That's all you need. <laughs> it starts there. Word of mouth, friend. Yif is what the shape of water is, according to Yif expert Adam. <laughs> water, the shape of water is like a Mickey Mouse head. It's the shape two of water. Oxygen, uh, one hydrogen. <laughs> Man, funny. I'm sorry. Two hydrogen, one oxygen. Blue. The shape of water is about a monster person, not a not a furry or scaly. There's a difference. He's not an anthropomorphic like fish. He's a creature, the Black Lagoon like creature. He's there's a, person, a difference. He's a person before the fish. It, no, it's just there's a difference between like a monster person and a furry. There's not a difference. When you're jacking off, there isn't. The, only <laughs> when you're jacking off. That's the only time it makes a difference. Don't insult my fish man. Uh, Sarah couldn't be fucked to uh, correct her spelling before she yelled at us. <laughs> Don't be fucked. Don't insult my. Don't. Don't. I sound like Desi Arnaz. Don't. Okay. 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 We shan't do that anymore. <laughs> Uh, and just as uh, an aside, water H two O is a polar molecule because it's lopsided. The hydrogens are at the top together, the negative side and the positive side. That's why it's such a good at dissolving things. The more you know, it's a universal uh, solvent, right? Mm -hmm. Science. I'm like Bill Fucking Nye. Yeah. No bow ties. <laughs> okay, and so there's one thing left, but you have to close your eyes. Okay. Eyes closed. So we can show the the stream. And open oh. your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Is are they t-shirts? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. We gotta wear these during the next live stream. <laughs> We we'll just put them on right now. It's already warm as fuck in here. I'm gonna <laughs> put this on over my other shirt. It just goes on right over top, dude. Actually, this actually feels kind of nice. It does feel nice. It is a Sam's Club. <laughs> How much does Sam's Club charge for this kind of shit? I think it was like twelve dollars a piece. That's not terrible. I'm <laughs> warm as fuck. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna put mine on right now. <laughs> I, 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 believe me. I fucking know. It is. <laughs> it is warm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That is a fair. <laughs> oh boy. We're going. Is... Jake, turn the damn AC on. Do you want to hear what it sounds like when we turn the AC on? <laughs> All right. <laughs> AC time. Just a, maybe a little quick blast. <laughs> <laughs> I need some more water. Mm. How's that sound? Oh, it feels so good. Do you like that? <laughs> it does feel good. <laughs> Do you like that? Is that what you want? This is what you made me become. <laughs> <laughs> that scene. It's not that bad. Okay, fuck you guys. <laughs> oh, thank God. If this is not that bad, we're turning it on every time. <laughs> not for recorded episodes, though. Sound quality is paramount. Yes. For those audios, audio files out there. That's right. Did you say audio slaves? I said audio files. I know, but you kind of... I would... I, I, That's I, a band. I, no That's kidding. I was wondering. 
kind of inception-y with the t-shirt, the pillow, than the actual person. <laughs> and bit. just to say, there is more stuff with my face on it in the pipeline. By the way, uh, <laughs> if you're a patron, this next, this next, you should, you should have your envelope for this month already. But this next coming, yeah, uh, this next coming. There's probably going to be Paul pictures. In a there. little something extra. Um, I don't know how many. You if you wanted to masturbate to them, I would. Frankly, I would take it as a compliment. Yeah, it's going to go from the top down though. So when we run out, that's when we run out. So if you're lucky enough to get one, <laughs> take advantage. Even if you don't want to jerk off to it, just think about all the people who could but can't. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, so it's a superiority thing at a certain point. You're better than them. <laughs> yes, Paul. <laughs> um, what else we got? Wait. Oh, it took me a long time to realize the usual background, but from a different angle. Uh, yeah. That's, yeah, you can see the, the fun much little sign, goes. the yeah. books of the Bible. Yep. I, I was so impressed. I was so impressed with myself when I found these on. Um, it's pretty great. On, on um, where was it? Um, uh, Oriental Training Company. They also had like a full size or like this huge like boulder and Jesus tomb thing. <laughs> cool. You, you, you should go on there sometime. They have all kinds of weird, like, religious crap. What are they, just, what's their, Oriental like, thing? Training. What do they sell? They sell, like, uh, really, like, they sell, like, party supplies and, like, little cheap little tchotchkes if you're, like, a teacher and you hand out, like, erasers to, my sister's a teacher. Strong, we're, we're united. I'm going to check this out. Oriental Trading Company. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is he your CEO? Are you the CEO? Yes. Okay, we're gonna have, we, we demand a raise immediately. <laughs> Nick, I will take your request under advisement. Okay. No. Oh, good. It worked. <laughs> oh man, they have a whole religion section. Beautiful. Who does? The Oriental Society Training got that Company. From. Oh. Oh yeah. These could be. I'm just spitballing. Oh yeah. These could be uh, Patreon reward. Like yeah. these could be specialized things and yeah. stuff. Personalized stuff. We find it. Yeah. Personalized religious stuff. I just mean like with like something like this, but with like. TBR I would love to sell the like... TBR floor mat. <laughs> That'd be great. I would love to step on your face every morning. <laughs> or you know, I could sit on it. Oh look, creepy! They have I was caught being good coins. That's literally <laughs> what want, it's called. Okay, how many do you get for my... five? How many do you get for five bucks? I want one of those Hold in on. my envelope. You get uh, 144 for five dollars. <laughs> order that right now. Oh my god! Order it. it. Do it right now. That is an extra. Let's start a cart. You go. <laughs> okay. You Hold should on. go and sign up for Patreon immediately. And now you don't have to be a Paul. You don't have to, you know. Right. It doesn't have you have to step your game up that much. And although I, I, you know, personally, let's let's talk. Let's rap a little. I would like some competition, so bring it. <laughs> Wait. Let's wrap a little. Mic drop. I, I didn't have a mic microphone. And I really didn't want to throw your microphone Yeah, the floor. that would be bad. It might actually unhook. <laughs> Although, I got to say, USB cable has been working great. It has been. <laughs> it's been doing just fine. I really like this new TV. Um, if you go to Twitter, you can see pictures of or video it. of me in progress, <laughs> pictures screwing it into the wall. Yeah, it, not you know. Yeah, I've had this thing in a closet for <laughs> ages. Oh, just come out of the closet already, right? <laughs> if I become a patron, do I get Paul? <gasps> Maybe. Don't even. <laughs> How many do you get? Four. Hold on. Only a four count. Uh, six. Oh. That's oh god damn it. That's funny though. Yeah. <laughs> that's Jesus, a, fidget spinners. spinners. How did boy that that really fizzled? That you know, um, fidget spinners had about the same lifespan as pogs. Anyone my age will I remember love pogs. pogs. Loved them. <laughs> they lasted just about as long as fidget. You know spinners. what? I had Power Ranger pogs. I had lots of pogs. I don't know if I had any. I don't remember any specific. Well, you can get 50 religious stamps <gasps> for $12. Those can't go in an envelope, but the coins can. No, but I'm saying you can oh. stamp them on stuff. Oh! oh! He's, this one. This one. This guy. This guy. Glow-in-the-dark faith rubber bla bracelets. <gasps> Giant inflatable whale. I just want this for myself. <laughs> That'd be good for the Jonah part. Yeah. That's a really good bit. It's only $19. That's actually really cheap. 
I told they, 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 the people are wrong? the best. Go out to uh, uh, enter code Hugo and Jake at checkout. <laughs> How much for a uh, Paul doll? I don't think we have that in the budget. Oh, oh, like a real Paul doll, you know, like a real doll. In... Oh, that's upwards of twenty thousand. But if you just want, <laughs> wait, like you a... could just, I, you know, to be honest, I'm I'm, I'm cheaper than twenty thousand. Ten. <laughs> you could get Paul in person. Five hundred. <laughs> I'll be on call. Yeah. Religious slap bracelets. <gasps> I kind of really like that a lot, but the envelopes would go. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be very mad at us. Oh, slap bracelets. Did anyone actually ever I I heard the urban legend. As again, as you haven't noticed, I'm old ish. I'm 34. I remember slap bracelets, but I remember hearing like some kid like cut their wrist with a slap bracelet. Probably true. Someone wants a 12 inch. And then they banned them at school. They banned everything at our school. They were the worst. Religious paratrooper. It's one of those army. Oh yeah, we throw the <laughs> It's one of those army men that you throw in the parachute, but it's Jesus. What? I like that. I like that. Jesus never jumped out of a you plane. You get 48? What's next to 48? You get 48 for $13. I love this. This uh, site's great. We're going to use the shit out of this. Someone, someone wants uh, a 12 inch action figure, Paul. Well, like wait. Karate chops. Hugo, you have, um, you have a 3D printer. Yeah. I, I authorize you to use my likeness. Oh, God. I don't know how to model. <laughs> I don't know how to 3D model, though. I'll just wait. I'll just sit here and you can. 3D model. I need it. There's actually 3D scanning programs. Yeah. So, yeah. You can use my likeness. I uh, We have the same 3D printer. Ooh, tech mm. decks and those little BMX things. You guys remember those? Yeah. I saw that they had some on here, too. <laughs> Jesus spoke English and he jumped What's, out of what planes. Moses and the Ten Commandments wind-ups. <laughs> They're like little wind-up toys where it's Moses. But it's I like, feel like these are... Some of these are like borderline... This uh, is amazing. These are a little like... <laughs> blast... Yeah. <laughs> All right. Just to make sure, uh, we are on last call for questions. We're probably going to go uh, five to ten minutes. Closing time. Yeah. Wow. They have Jesus is my rock stress. What about the glow rocks? sticks? So the glow you sticks. Rave, rave we could get, for the we Lord. could get turned up. <laughs> Do they also have like the whistles for the rave? Wow. Oh, cross shaped clappers that go up. Do you oh, remember gosh. the uh, you remember the rave scene in Hell House? Yeah, I love. Wait, what, which which one was where they drew the pentagram or it, the star, that was yeah. that was Hell House where they drew a pentagram <laughs> yeah. but they accidentally did a star of David. David. And this is here's something else. The pentagram is actually a symbol of protection. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to actually protect you. It doesn't call call spirits. It protects you from spirits. Boom, mind blow. But maybe, but maybe, if there's spirits hanging around you so much, and according to that guy, you. there's nothing white in the in the satanic ceremonies. Nothing white. The, no, the guy. Remember, the guy was like, "Oh, well, we had a satanist come through here a year or two ago, and he said there was nothing white in the." Go watch that. Is just in general, you should watch that movie full, from start to finish. It's yeah. a really good movie. If you After guys, you watch the review again, obviously. <laughs> if, you get, if you guys ever do come to Scotland, can I buy you guys a pint or two? Of course. Of course, his name is Michael McGyver. That makes sense. From Scotland. I don't know what my YouTube name would be. Mm, mm, the Paul Allen. Yeah, I kind of I kind of had that locked up. Yeah, I think that's just the way you got to go. <laughs> yeah. Actually, you know, I, uh, I, you can, okay, fine. My, if you go to facebook.com slash the Paul Allen, that's my Facebook website. Wow. Doxed himself. Oh, that's brave man. The Paul Allen. Is that not a thing? Is that not a thing you're supposed to say? I don't know. I just, no, it's fine. <laughs> I just, you're inviting a lot of people. I don't actually, <laughs> I don't actually, I have not updated it. The <laughs> only time my Facebook ever gets updated is when, um, Scott, my husband, tags me in like a photo. <laughs> yeah, I ben I Fitter, I didn't get the first part of the live stream. Did you get the capture card I sent? Uh, yes. If, yes. Yes. Thank you. We will be using it. And uh, I don't know if you saw the part where we got this VHS. We'll probably use it on this. <laughs> we also have this one. Yeah. The double one. But wait, can you even 
Does yeah. Paul live in the Montrose area? That's where Houston keeps its gays. We were talking actually, about this yeah, no, today. this actually came up earlier. Uh, it used to be where we kept their gays. Then all the fucking rich people came in, and all the yuppies. And um, after we had gayed up the place, <laughs> tore down all the houses and built fucking monster. I was just going to say, stop cleaning up neighborhoods, it's, it's, and rich people will stop following you. <laughs> yeah. It's gay gentrification. Is I feel like is that that feels wrong saying that gentrification. Gentrification. <laughs> where, 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 where? <laughs> I think mean, it feels. Like... I love, I love the idea that there's like. <laughs> Here's the gay place, like your hordes, like <laughs> we, uh, bees that we, just well, hive know, together. You know, gays, we tend to travel in well-groomed packs. Yes. Uh, what's, what's, a, what's a flock of gays called? Uh, I don't know. What's... It's still just a gaggle. <laughs> Good one. No, but is there a gay area of Houston now? That's the Montrose. I mean, it's still Montrose, or yeah, I mean, that's where all the gay bars are still. You seemed a little upset about it earlier when we talked about it, though. Like, there's you had a spot, and now it's just oldies, old folks. (laughs) No, it's not only that; it's you know, young people, you know, or you know, hipsters, Google people. Yeah, it's Mm kind of yeah, those people. Get out of here! You know who you are. Get out of here! We don't want your money. No, we. I do. Uh, any chance you guys do collab with Deep Fat Fry? Uh, we actually tried once, but um, uh, TJ and Paul were having issues with their side of it. We were in the Skype call for like 45 <laughs> minutes, um, which I'm not complaining about because I had a good time. I was just sitting and chatting with TJ and Paul on and off while they were trying to figure out their uh, stuff. But it was early on, so yeah, we'll probably do it. I, uh, I wouldn't mind doing a YouTube channel, uh... But um, I'd rather really, I'd rather do it with someone else. I don't really want to do it by myself, and so it's trying to find someone that I, you know. Yeah. My neighbor and I, we were actually we were kind of pitching. He likes to play video games. I'm not a huge huge video game person, so we were kind of we were kind of thinking about having like a you know good versus bad. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> um, oh, Ashley's back from basic training. Hi, He's- Ashley. My sister is named Ashley, too. Maybe it's your sister. Mm. And she went to secret basic training. Yeah. <laughs> Left the kids. <laughs> yeah. Um, Paul, do a yiff. Uh, that's only got one F. Uh, it's it's uh, vetoed. Ah, I love how Paul always talking about myself, himself. Thank you. I, you know, you're not the first person to say that. I uh, and you know it's hard with these guys, but normally I do monopolize the conversation. My coworkers always <laughs> say that. Lenny, so you are very observant. Lenny Leonard is upset that uh, with all this gay talk, it made me remember that Hugo and Jake are not a couple, <laughs> and how sad that is. <laughs> I guess I've never considered it. No. Yeah. So wait, let me just back to the Facebook thing. So if they're not friends, can they post things on my? Depends on your settings. I don't know. I haven't like five years ago. So by now, my I've been completely trolled. Yeah, it's <laughs> over. I don't have a Facebook, or if I do, it's just not you so do. Cool. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> okay, so I have one. Yeah. Go nuts. Good luck. Oh um, wait, I want Paul to hug. I, oh, I want a Paul hug. Steve Smith. Okay, get at me. Um, I really, you know, like I would say get at me at Twitter. I'm not on Twitter, but you can DM me on the disc. I am on discord. Yeah. Uh, is it just the Paul Allen? I think so. Or Paul Allen or Palin. I think I'm Palin on the discord. Yeah. Yeah. You, you know, I I actually, if you look under super fan, I'm under the super, I'm the only one under the super fan. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, and if you're not a member of the discord, you should do so. The reason people all got excited when Ashley was here is because she's very popular in the discord. And so she's back. Uh, I oh, wait. wait. R.I.P. Paul's Facebook wall. <laughs> no, number 8813. That's your badge number. Oh. Um, um, I fear the Discord. Have no fear. Um, I Wait. As I walk through the valley of the shadow of darkness, I fear, death. No, I fear no evil. Yeah, haven't you ever Give heard that this, Coolio song? Yeah. Give us this day or daily bread as we forgive those who trespass again. I feel like I missed the yeah, part there. Yeah, you did. I don't know. We're about to do it, though, I think. Yeah. 
We're about to do that part, isn't it, Daniel? I don't know. That's the best Off part. The top of my head, I don't remember. That's that's what I remember from all those, you know, all the time going to the Episcopal church service. Besides the fact that you know, by law, Episcopal services can only last like fifty minutes. <laughs> We're real short. <laughs> you know what? I respect a religion that kind of goes, you know what, guys? You really don't want to be here anyway. <laughs> let's put it in the rules. 50 minutes, let's get the fuck back home. No. Done. Our, our, our follow. Wait, I, I, I follow love you. you. Not. Uh, you the best. 2.56 Canadian dollars. Take this equivalent to two U.S. dollars and give it to Paul. Ding, 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 ding. I bought you ice cream earlier. Though. <laughs> I, a custard. A custard. <laughs> That's true. Man, I could just do this forever. This is this. You guys have the best job. It's a pretty great ever. job. We got a Megazord today, so <laughs> <laughs> people just send you things. You're like, uh, um, you need to do the money shot. I guess I did that earlier when the thing flew everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Should have. Damn it! Can we go back and redo that? And I'll say money shot. Help him with two dollars <laughs> and change. No, I actually like Paul. <laughs> Maybe next time. Okay, last call. Last call. You got three minutes. Seven fifty is when it's over. Uh, this is the can I just stay here. in here? You guys, you can go. Yeah. We'll, 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 let's talk. Let's get. Let's get real. Let's let's <laughs> let's have a real heart to heart here. The song or the group. Shut up, Jake. We'll talk when we want. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, we won't talk back in three minutes. Um, oh, okay. I have to give you a money shot on camera. The ch if the ch the chat says so, we have to do it. That that's the rules. Well, if you if you mix with the green, when's your review of Deadpool two? I, We're gonna uh, do it on Monday. Doing a Monday on the tangent, on or, the tangent. Or, Tuesday, or Tuesday on the tangent. Monday or Tuesday. You know, if someone, I'm sorry. That's it. If someone wants to do, you know, if someone has an idea for a YouTube thing, get at me at the Discord. We may be able to do something. There you go. We could, you know, you guys did it from, you guys did it apart. Yeah. yeah, it's not hard. I mean, it's hard. Now I know what it's software. It's not easy. Now I know what software to use. It's to not hard it. to get each other in a call. <laughs> it's hard. It's hard, <laughs> the, it's hard to, the to, do, part to is... do the job. <laughs> Uh, harder than not physically hard though. Wait, can I just send you like let's say we record it? Can I just send it to you to edit and you take care? You'll take care of that. <laughs> yeah, we have plenty of time to do that. I would, I would require so much more. Wait, we could be a sub channel. I, uh, I'm these ideas are just firing. Okay, you can start a sub channel <laughs> branded off us, and then you get a bunch of people on your downline, and they start a channel. <laughs> And they get people on there. <laughs> Everybody pays us fifty percent. Absolutely, it's basically like I'm not going to say it because I don't want to get sued, but it it uh, rhymes with Barry uh, Way. It's Ramadan, guys. <laughs> Do more current. We got a strike on that community strike. We have two strikes on that channel. Yeah, now. we don't get paid for anything we put on there. So it's wait. How do you? Uh, we knew that was going to happen at some point. What's your favorite thing or body part from? Wait, Paul, what is your fave thing or body part from Hugo and Jake? Mm. I like you. You're like a big teddy bear. Uh, and I like your face. There you go. Okay. Faces. <laughs> Boom. Um, <laughs> is, uh, does Hugo reject, re regret choosing Hugo as his alias? You chose nothing in that. It was forced upon you. Long, I, before I, I met you. And I regret nothing by continuing that trend. Yeah. Um, Jake's eyes for sure. Guys, some people are starting to objectify us. People are saying, like, Hugo's got Hugo's yeah, head I, on Jake's body or Jake's head on Hugo's. I am not a piece of meat, pe people. You're right. I like your face. That's kind of bad. Ouch. Uh, how Hugo that? has good nips. Do you have pretty good nips? How is saying I like your face bad? I have no idea. These people are terrible. <laughs> That's like your. All right, it's over. It's over. You better pick one because I'm 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 undoing it. So you guys better pick one. Unless someone were to super chat right pick it now. Off. You better. You have three seconds. Uh, Eight seconds. Jake has prolapse nips. I don't know what that is. It like they puff out. <laughs> uh. Uh, 
It's over. And that was the biggest penis I had ever seen. 